Hi, Bob with Knives Town here. I'd like to do a review for you today on a knife made by Kershaw. Uh, this is the uh, Kershaw Folding Field Knife number 1050. Uh, this is a really sweet knife and I've uh, uh, kind of taken a shine to it, so uh, I'd like to share it with you here, show you what we've got. Uh, it comes in a, uh, a nice uh, silver box here, like with that, there's the, uh, the Kershaw uh, 1050. 1050 uh, label on it there uh, and the box opens up to reveal the knife uh, that does come with a sheath and here is the sheath it's a nice leather sheath here I'll give you a, give you a shot of that there it's a nice nice stitched leather sheath uh, very nice looking. It says it's got the Kershaw name on it right there. You can see that heavy stitching. It's uh, it's the belt loop is is just made for just a traditional belt that will accept uh, about a two to two and a quarter inch wide belt, right there. It opens with a snap, a nice heavy snap. You can see that. The knife also arrives in plastic. There you go. That's a handsome knife. Um, you can see here it opens with a nail nick and uh, that opens up like there with a nail nick. And there we go. Let's take a look at that. Look at that, you can see my fingerprint on there already. The, the blade is so mirror polished. Uh, this blade here uh, is made of uh, AUS 8A. Uh, very mirror polished, as you can see. It's already showing that my fingerprint just from opening it up. Uh, it's a mirror polished blade there. Uh, it is, uh, it's got the markings on it. I'll see if I can show those to you. 1050 Japan right there is what that says and then there's your Kershaw and that says uh, folding field it's uh, you know it's a, you can see it's a drop point hunting type knife uh, and uh, what we have is a, uh, a three and three quarter inch blade here uh, the overall length of the knife is eight and a quarter inches, and as far as weight goes, this is this has got uh, some real good heft to it. That weighs eight point six ounces, uh, so it's got it's it's a it's a hefty knife, and it it really feels that that weight gives it a feel of quality in your hand. Uh, the handles are uh, made from phenolic resin, which is a, a smooth. Uh, it's a very smooth type of material it's a it's a it's a molded uh, uh, resin um, phenolic resin is a molded molded plastic resin uh, and that is pinned to the brass frames uh, the entire frame is brass the bolsters as well as the liners are brass and it is uh, the scales the phenolic scales are pinned to that with brass pins as you can see there it is a back lock. And you can see that's uh, not an open frame design like some of the other knives we see. Uh, there is uh, jimping here on the, on the top of the blade to get, your, to get some, some traction on your thumb. And that is, that's good effective jimping. 
What I like about this is the way it fits your hand, and I love. I really like these uh, these finger grooves. You can see how the how the the handle is shaped here with these finger grooves, and and even the handle is molded. Uh, you can see here to accept your fingers right in there, uh, scalloped so to speak, right there for for your uh, for your fingers to fit right in there. Uh, it's got a front finger guard here and then a rear uh, sort of a butt and your your finger just your hands just lock right in on that right in on, right in there it's got a good feel it's got good weight to it so that'll give you good cutting power um, the the blade has plenty of belly to it for for uh, skinning or uh, just just field dressing game or any any use that you might have the back lock closes up easily enough comes in a leather leather sheath you could just put it in your pocket if you wanted but it's a little heavy but it still it's not it's not so huge you couldn't do that that's a very nice knife and a nice leather sheath. Highly recommended. Well, thanks a lot. I'll see you again.